What time is it? It's Mr. Pickle's bath time, yeah! You know it is. I thought, you know what? I got a thermostat. Oh, don't eat the corn, Mr. Pickles. I got a thermostat hooked up. Because I want to see how warm I make the quote-unquote lukewarm water for Mr. Pickles' baths. And he's ready for bath time. I thought I'd change it up. You want to know something? We're going to do this together. Let's just walk in this, this bathroom that's under construction. And this is the hot. This is the cold. I get it. That feels, feels about right. And I take a little bit of stress coat and I go blurpy blurp. Not very much. That's about right. About right, I say. He loves his bath time because it's time. Alright. It's like a one gallon or maybe two gallon bucket and we walk it over to Mr. Pickles because we took him out of his beautiful exotic cage because he loves it so and we pour it I pour it on the back side of him just doesn't splash him in the face there you go Mr. Pickles here's some wowie wah yeah he's like yeah pour it right there right on there yeah ooh don't eat my cord, Mr. Pickles. Don't eat the thermostat. He's spunky. Also, I thought I just uploaded a video. And I was getting people like thinking Mr. Pickles was dead. What? Like how those those movie stars or whatever, you get somebody and oh yeah, he passed away. And it turns out to be a hoax. Like, is Mr. Pickles really that famous? Like, seriously? That's a little warm. That's a little warm. See, I gotta get it just so. Ooh, that's just so. Just so good on my skin. I wanna do it over and over again. Alright, right there. Alright. Bring it up. Ooh, look at that water. Got a little stress coat in there. Pickles. So no, Mr. Pickles, this is a this is I'm literally gonna do this and upload it. So ooh. Hold on, I gotta hold on a second. We're at 85 degrees. We gotta go high. Ooh. We'll set it high at 90. I don't think it's that high. No. Where are we at? We're at 86 degrees. Of course, it might take a little bit of time. Oh, Mr. Pickles sitting right in the thermostat. Don't toot on it, Mr. Pickles. We don't need a false reading. 86. So, yeah, I thought, you know what? He's alive. Then someone was saying, then, it's, then people are saying, like, oh, he's so unhealthy. I mean, come on. Mr. Pickles is super duper healthy. I don't know where this is all coming from. All these false accusations. And, you know, I mean, someone did bring up a good point that, you know, it's not a good idea just to listen to one person's comments because, you know, they might be doing it away. They have water. They have well water. They have, you know, oh, I guess a little higher. Where are we at so far? 88 degrees. We're going to set the 99 degrees. There we go. 88 degrees. It's nice and warm. See, and the thing is, it's I guess it is warm. Lukewarm. I, I don't think that's hot at all. Um, but you know, it's not a good idea just to go on one person's opinion. <clears throat> and I'm not gonna just sit here and just say my way is the only way. You don't if you don't do it my way. Well, then you're just harming your animal. Da, 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 da. No. No. Nope. I do it my way. Mr. Pickles is six years old. As beautiful as ever. I'll probably go to the bathroom here in a second. Um, but I've, I've had no problems. Maybe in the winter, 
in the winter, there's a couple times where he just isn't hungry. I don't know. I mean, summertime, he's always hungry. He's hungry almost. He's Well, he'll let me know when he's hungry. He starts kind of, especially when I open his door, he's like alert, like immediately alert. I know he's hungry. And I take him out. I will usually go get food the next day and take him out and feed him. This summer has been insane, busy. So I apologize for not uploading many videos. But look at tonight. You're getting double the dosage, double the pleasure, double the fun with Mr. Pickles time. It's tub time. He loves tub time. Should we get him a little bit more tub time? Oh, yeah, 89 degrees. That's pretty warm. Yeah, it's not mega hot. Let's give him a little bit more so we can, he can go a little bit of snorkeling. I can do too much more. He doesn't do it. Yeah. Well, we've seen it. He's just like, what in the? Dial that down. Just touch, touch. It's loop. That's pretty. I mean, it's it's not hot. It's not something I'd want to take a shower in. Oop. A little bit more stress coat. You're going to have a coat of stress free on in this tubby tub. So, yeah, I mean, of course, if you want to say negative statements, I don't care. <laughs> I think they're all pretty funny. We love each other. But no. Here we go. Turbulent times with Mishta Mishta. There you go. Now we can soak. Soak in time. So we got 89 degrees. This is pretty much, I just want to make sure this is normal. Now, I do have an under tank heater for the winter because it's, I mean, your house is usually, what, 74 degrees in the winter? I mean, I already got my winter PJ bottoms on. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer right on. Yep, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer because they're comfy. Um, so I'll plug in that heater because, I mean, if he's, he likes to, I like giving him a bath for like an hour or two. Just leave him in here while I watch TV. Then dry him off. You can sit on my lap while I watch TV. Because that's how a king gets it done. <laughs> I consider myself a king. Mr. Mr. So me and, me and Prince, Prince Pickles will watch TV. But I wait for him to go to the bathroom first. Don't need that on my lap, I'll tell you that much. So what are we at? 89 degrees. So maybe, I mean, you know, I'd say that's pretty average what I do. Maybe in the summertime when it's kind of warm out, I might give it a little less, but it's it might be a couple degrees higher than I normally do. But he doesn't seem to mind. And if you guys have a constipated frog, this is the way to do it. If you're noticing that your frog isn't going number two a whole lot, just every day, give him a warm bath like this for like an hour or two. You do it about two or three times, he's going to give, he's going to go to the bathroom. I mean, it's from my experience. I don't want to make that as a solid fact. But if it does seem to just get, get the tummy rumbling, get stuff moving. So there's a whole bunch of advice from me. You take it for what it's worth. And I don't think I've ever disagreed with a veterinarian. Someone said I disagree with veterinarians or something. I don't remember disagreeing with a veterinarian. Um, the only thing that I am pretty adamant about is not having a water dish. And that's because I talked to a local guy who lived in Africa next to these frogs. I mean, I got my information from a guy who lives there. Who's the tribes around him eat these things. They're like a delicacy over there. They know how to catch them. They know where they're sitting. So, and he told me they don't ever, he's never seen one in open water. So he goes, they're always under a bush. They're always in some, you know, moist soil under, a, under shade. That's where they sit. And the only time they're in open water might be to go to the bathroom from away from their bush or when they have eggs, when they're, when they're, you know, in the mating season in spring. The males will protect the eggs, but once once he's done protecting those eggs, he's not in that water. That's what I was told. And Mr. Pickles is six years old. 
healthy as all can be. Yeah, what's the date today? Got to be close to October 1st. What's the date? I don't know. It's past September 29th, so it's Monday. I don't know. I don't know the date. <laughs> Somebody post the date for me, please. Well, we'll see when I upload it. But I'll upload this quick. But no, I don't disagree with vets. I don't disagree with anybody. I don't, you know, you guys have your, your special way of doing it and your buddy's probably really healthy and happy. Keep doing what you're doing. Mr. Pickles is right here. We're looking at him. How beautiful he is. Hopefully he doesn't attack my TV. <laughs> and his eyes are bright and clear. His colors on his arms and you can see he's fully colored. The lighting in here kind of brutal, but you loving it. So there you go. Double the pleasure, double the fun tonight, guys. Sorry I didn't upload videos. I'll try. I'm going to upload more. We'll get her done. Right on. So say bye, Mr. Pickles. See ya.